Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. This Diane's Decorating and More. Hi guys, hope you're doing great out there today. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you how I fix my broccoli cheese casserole along with fried turkey wings. Yes, fried turkey wings. Something I'm putting together here in the home and I just wanted to share with you how I do my version of that. Okay, and I want to say thank you to everyone out there for showing your support and subscribing, guys. We're on our way to a thousand subscribers, so stay tuned here on the channel as we get started, okay? And we're going to go ahead and fix everything deliciously prepared, listed, everything. It's going to be shared with you in the comment section of the video of everything how I use and what I use in this preparing of the meal. So stay tuned. All right, first up, we're gonna go ahead and add in our onions because we want those to pretty much um, soften up a little bit, kind of saute and season the oil, okay? And it's just a little oil in here, not much. So we're gonna add that in, and as you always know, my purple onions are my favorite. You can choose whatever onion you'd like to use yourself. But the purple onions are my favorite, guys. So we're gonna let that saute just a little bit there. Just until it gets a little soft. Okay, next up we're going to go ahead and add in our broccoli and I did um, cut these in two and so that they could cook a little evenly. This type of broccoli is called bird's eye broccoli. You can use any type of broccoli you choose. But this particular one is packaged by Birdseye. Just in case you want to know that. Alrighty. We're going to let that steam a little bit. We're going to cover it and let it steam down a little bit and mix in well with the onions. Okay? Tell this is gonna be really good. It smells so good. Okay, popping back on to share with you the different seasonings here that I'm gonna be adding into the broccoli and the rice. And I'll be sure to list the amount I use and exactly what I use in the broccoli and rice okay all right so you have your paprika and you have your onion powder your garlic powder you have your black pepper you have your chicken seasoning you have your slap your mama and you have your parsley okay so that is what we have here and i will list that again that in the video uh, for you guys okay so that way you know exactly what i used and how much. just about right okay so now we're going to go ahead and remove our lid off of here and we're going to add in some of the rice and this is the 
basmati rice. Okay, it's already been cooked and prepared. And, and you, you basically prepare this rice similar to the way you do, um, say, your Mahatma or any other rice, Podophilus rice, um, if you have that. Okay? And so you're just going to add some of that in. going to stir that in with that, with the broccoli. Just mix it in really, really good. You already turned the fire off because it's going to also bake in the oven for about, about 30 minutes at 375. And that's just to melt the cheese that I'm going to put in there. really good really really good that's exactly what you want to see how those green colors pop in there with that rice guys perfect all right okay so now we're going to add in some of our seasoning just a touch of each one Like what I see, like what I see. Okay, you're gonna toss that, get those seasons all worked down through there. Yes, smell that, that smells perfect. Absolutely delicious, guys, absolutely delicious. Yes, yes, yes. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and move it to our prepared pan here that we're going to transfer everything over into there. Okay. All right. I tell you, this smells so good. Now we're gonna put a layer of our cheese onto there as well. Here I have uh, mozzarella. Okay. Just a touch, just a touch. And then I also have some of your sharp cheddar. Just a touch of that. As well as some Monterey Jack. Top it off with just a little bit more of the cheese here on top. Try to get all of that out of there. Okay. Some more of the pepper jack. And maybe a touch more of the sharp cheddar just because I can. <laughs> and as I said before, we're gonna pop this into the oven at 375 for about 30 minutes. Just enough time to melt the cheese, guys. So stay tuned and I'll show you exactly what that looks like once it comes out of the oven. One more thing before I put this in the oven, guys, I wanna come back and show you that I did use 
um, a 10 and a half ounce of a can of cream of celery in the broccoli and rice okay so i wanted to make sure i pop back on and put that in this video all right now we're ready to put it in the oven so it can bake <laughs> stay tuned okay so next up we're going to go ahead and get started on frying our turkey wings now the turkey wings that i have here are smoked turkey wings right and i took them out of the package washed them and i boil them yes i did because some smoked turkey wings come with a lot of salt and it really takes away from the flavor in my opinion of the meat so i boil mine to make them a little bit more tender and to get rid of some of that salt guys so i boil these for about two and a half hours yes and they are tender and they taste good you see how flaky that is Look at that, come straight off. And that's what you're looking for, okay? So now we're gonna go ahead, add just a touch of seasoning, okay? I'm gonna mix it all in here. The remaining seasoning that I had left over from the broccoli and rice, okay? Just mix it all in just like that, right? Just like that, just mixing it all in. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna tilt this down a little bit so you guys get a chance to see what I'm doing here. And it's just basically adding it to the outer coat of the turkey wings, okay? Just like that, just seasoning it really, really good. Because turkey really, to me, don't require a lot of seasoning. Really don't. It's a tasty meat and a good alternative to chicken. Okay. All right. All right. So now that we have some of that seasoning on there, I'm going to cut our fire down just a little bit because it is piping hot. In here, I have some flour and a touch of meal. And I'm just going to mix that in there really good. And I'll be sure to list exactly the right measurements for you guys of how much meal and flour combination I'm putting in here. All right. And we're just gonna take this, take one of our wings here, just place it in there like that, and put a little bit of flour and meal mixture on top. Just a little bit, just to coat it. And it's not going to take long to cook, guys, because it's already boiled tender. All right. All right. Just enough. Okay. Now it looks just like that. Perfect, and that's what you want to see. Put our leg in there. Okay. Add that in there. A little crumb pieces of the meat. Drop the net in there. Nothing goes to waste. Alright. Cover 
that back up. Let that continue. And I'm going to show you what the fried turkey wings look like. Okay. All the way around there, guys. All the way around. Okay, and I'm going to take it, turn it over so you can get a good close up look at that. Still hot to the touch, but I have gloves on. Look at that. Absolutely delicious. I can't wait to get my mouth on this. All right. Now we're going to wait for our last piece cook. And then we're going to come back. And I'll show you what everything looks like finished. So stay tuned. Okay, guys, we're back and everything is finished. Yes, our broccoli and cheese is finished. And our fried turkey wings are finished as well. I'm popping back on right quick to give you a close-up look of everything. All right, so we're going to go ahead and serve this dish up right quick. a little bit of this out of here. Just a little bit. It is piping hot still. I wanted to pop on here and show you guys exactly what this looks like. Plate it up. Okay. There you go, guys. That looks absolutely delicious. Yes, it does. Oh, a smell of vision exists. I tell you, this broccoli rice smells absolutely delicious. Okay, there we go. And that's it, guys. That's the end of another video, okay, for making these delicious fried turkey wings and broccoli and cheese. Casserole. So thank you so much for stopping by the channel today and joining me. You all go out and have a great one. And I hope that you have enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, share, subscribe to the channel, guys. Let me know what you think about this dinner here that I put together, okay? Share some tips on how you would do your turkey wings or your broccoli and cheese casserole. Truly would appreciate that. All right, we'll see you in the next video, guys. Y'all have a wonderful day or evening or whatever you are. See you next time.